it's kind of neat. I put this little uh, LED bulb up here. Sorry, I just got my crappy little cell phone. But it's bushing out there under the little LED, but here, I'll shut it off here. Hold on a second. I'll shut it off here. So it's still getting quite a bit of light from the T5 right there, but it's got a direct light from the LED there. So bright lights, bright lights. LEDs are fucking bright lights. Yeah. I don't know. You guys can go ahead and grow with LEDs. These are looking really good. Yeah, get them over here. This one here. It's getting bush here and the one back there is doing better under a little 18 watt light. So I don't know. This here a lot of people saying LEDs the future. I guess only time will tell. They've been around for 10 years and I don't think they've done much because why do you need a 1,000 watt LED? How are you going to replace the bulbs? <clears throat> See a T5? When the bulbs go out, or if they get, uh, yeah, the bulbs go out, you replace the bulbs. If you got 10 LEDs go out, like in a, like in a strip, you got to, it just seems like too much pain in the ass. You know, 15 lights go out in a panel, what are you going to do, tear it apart? No, you're going to take it back and probably be out of warranty by then, too. It just doesn't make a lot of sense. But whatever. Have fun to have at it, guys. If that's what you enjoy, life's short. Fuck it. So, fuck it. For me and my folks, we'll stick with the bright lights. Bright light, bright light, motherfucker. That's pretty impressive, though, for a little LED bulb. For the main light, it's grown quite a bit. See, it was just a baby there, and now it's doing pretty damn good. It likes that little LED bulb. They're buddies. It likes the bright light. Yep, not too shabby, motherfuckers.